I was absolutely blown away. I was so moved. It was one of the most compelling site visits uh, that I'd ever had at a nonprofit. What would it be like to be living in one place, come home from school at two o'clock with your bags packed on the doorstep saying, we're moving you to Riverside? One of the really niche areas that we're interested in is foster care. As a parent, it's, it's hard to imagine that that can ever happen to a child. These are our children in our community who need us, who have been left, who have been abandoned, and they need our help. We are constantly looking for who that's going to be, who's going to step up to the plate for our, our children. And that's what the team at Five Acres does every day. Make lives better for people and, and what could be more moving and more, more compelling than, than helping kids? We have our out-of-home care programs. These are the programs where the kids actually physically live with us. Our residential treatment center is our oldest program. That's what we're known for. Our children come to us because the Children's Course decided it was unsafe for them to live with their birth parents. The children that have come to us have been, you know, severely emotionally abused, neglected. Over the years, there was a concerted effort at, at a county level and at a state level and even uh, community partner level agencies like Five Acres to sh shrink down the length of time that kids stayed in foster care. Services would go into the home and work with the families where the kids were coming from. All of our community-based outpatient programs are focused more on preventative. Maybe there was a call to the county about some potential high-risk or at-risk abuse or neglect. Maybe the school has called because they notice a lot of family stress. The goal is to help the families to function healthier. Our school has been around since 1981, and what we do is we focus on the students who cannot make it out in public school um, in any type of a classroom. We support the students who need highly specialized care. We have crisis counselors, so if they're having difficulty in the classroom, either behaviorally or emotionally, they can actually take an exit from the classroom and go and work with our counselors and then re-enter. And our goal is always to get the students back into a less restrictive environment. It's not to capture them here. It's always to work on getting them back out into a less restrictive environment with their typical and same age peers. Permanency uh, at Five Acres is a goal that we've set uh, for several years now that every child that comes through any of the programs at Five Acres has a permanent connection and a permanent family that they'll be living with. As much as we love and care for our kids, they're true place is to be with a natural family setting. It really is, not an institution. We serve families and youth that are anywhere along the adoption continuum, from a child who is living in residential care or in foster care, all the way to the other end where a family could have adopted 5, 10, or 15 years ago and are needing some support. This is a very, very important cause. Every day, you know, Five Acres and the staff there do very hard and important work. When I was introduced to Five Acres and, and, and saw what they're doing for these disadvantaged kids, I, I really wanted to give something back to them and give them an opportunity to, to at least have a better life. You can give a check for $5 or you can volunteer for an afternoon. It's singularly the best thing I've done as a father. I introduced my children, they're 10 and 8, uh, to Five Acres a few years back. Uh, it really is a, is a lesson around, you know, we, we live a, a life that, that, that's not to be taken for granted. It is our obligation as members of our community to do that and to reach out and help these kids. All of us need to step up. All of us who are lucky enough, blessed enough. You have something to give to these kids. Fortunate enough to have benefited uh, positively uh, in our lives, uh, need to give back. Whether you knew it or not, you made an impact on this child, on this person's life. Five Acres, providing services to children and families in crisis for 125 years.